Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I'm so excited for today. I'm going to a Boys to Men concert tonight and I'm gonna do a little get ready with me. So the concert is in Philly and it's at eight o'clock tonight, but it's about a two hour drive with no traffic. So I already showered, I have my hair drying, I got the eyebrows on and I really wanna wear my hair down. The easiest way for that to look nice is to leave it in a bun and just let it dry for a while. Put this back up into a bun. And honestly, the bun looks kind of cute though right now. Okay, it's a little messy. I went to the gym this morning and while I was walking on the treadmill, I literally was trying to think like what I could wear. So I had a couple ideas. This one top I wanted to wear, I just wore it recently when I went on a date. So I'm like, hmm, I don't want to wear like the same outfit. The outfit wouldn't be the same, but the top would be. So then I thought of something else, which I think might even look a little bit better, which is this little ruffly looking thing. I don't know if I like it. I did wear it in a video. I'm pretty sure I wore it when I was doing a review of Gundry MD. I never wore this for anything else, but I thought maybe this with some black jeans and black little boots would look cute. Faux velvet or whatever. Y'all don't even judge the front of my shoes. I don't know if I want to wear them because they're a little worn out. And while I was at the gym, I don't know why I just was thinking a lot about this concert, but I low-key want to go on Ticketmaster too because I had seen my tickets and I wanted to log on I just want to make sure because I think technically the row that I have, it's row DDD, -D -D, which based off their seating chart should be technically row three, but I think it's actually considered row four. But I'm like, normally once you start going to the double and triple letters, that means it's like further back. So I want to take a screenshot of this seating chart because if I get to the concert and they're like, yeah, no, you're all the way back here. I don't know why I got like so paranoid about that for some reason. The section is pit one row DDD. -D -D. This is what like the stage is supposed to be like. So this is pit one is over here. Should be in this row. So it should be third row. I already put some lotion on. And I'm going to use my mattifying primer. I've been using this e.l.f. one this hydrating one which i think this was like a christmas gift it's honestly more like smoothing than hydrating so if you're looking for a hydrating primer i wouldn't even recommend that i mean i'm happy that all it does is smooth really because i don't like to be oily looking because i'm already oily naturally and i don't like to do eyeshadow but i'm gonna go in i feel like my eyelids actually look kind of dark but i'm just gonna use this little sephora eyeshadow this was in their advent calendar that i had gotten for christmas and it's the shade Flawless. So I used this the other day when I was filming that Valentine's Day house. I didn't apply a lot, kind of like, I think that's all I really did. But when I was watching that footage back, I'm like, I love how it just looks like all neutral. Like obviously you can pack it on, but I really just did like the bare minimum just to get it like all, you know, one color. It just, it looks so natural and like, I just liked how it looked, I don't know. And I'm going to go in with my Maybelline concealer. But I'm so happy because I've really wanted, and I think I talked about it a couple videos ago, Fenty Beauty came out with a whole football NFL inspired collection, obviously for Rihanna performing at the Super Bowl. You know, truthfully, all I wanted from this collection was the little football sponge and the stadium bag. Because next season, I don't care, I'm going to go to the football games. Hopefully I'll have, you know, someone to go with by then. But like, that was one thing for this year that that's why I never wanted to go. I don't want to go by myself and look all, not weird, but like feel uncomfortable because I'm there alone. You know what? I do so much stuff alone. I go to the gym alone. I run errands. I go to the store. I go shopping. Why do I care? Does it really matter? Obviously football tickets aren't the cheapest, but I'm tired of having this fear of going to things by myself. Not even that I'm scared to go alone, it's just like I care too much about what people think. I'm sure for one, I wouldn't be the only person there that's there by themselves. So basically what I was getting at though is that I wanted that Fenty Beauty stadium bag because I want to go to football games next year or next season. And I'm so happy I waited because they had it in the collection but you had to pay $76 for this collection. I was kind of talking, I wasn't talking bad about it but I'm just like I don't want any of that stuff really in that collection because it's like a couple of the things were samples and then it just wasn't the stuff that I wanted to get like you would get the sponge you get the bag but I'm like unless the two of them are $76 then okay it makes sense to get that collection but I'm like let me just wait I wind up spending $41 I think the bag was 25 and then the sponge was 16 
And you know what? I would rather spend 41 than 76. But okay, so I know I was just talking. Set my face with this banana powder. I use the Merit Balm bronzing little chubby stick. And I'm also gonna go in with a powder bronzer. I'm gonna use my Care Bears one just to go over that balm and I wanted to like kind of set that. And I'm so excited because I got two new things from Merit they sent me. So I have to do that at some point. I just feel like I've been really busy. So I feel bad because they get this stuff mailed to me so quickly. And then usually I'm pretty fast with it, but this week, like I'm not gonna lie, I just, I have a lot going on. I have this concert tonight. I just have to do stuff tomorrow and the Super Bowl is on. So obviously I'm gonna wanna watch the Super Bowl. Monday I have jury duty. Tuesday is Valentine's Day. So maybe on Tuesday I could get the Merit stuff tried on and filmed and everything small amount of concealer for this big of a forehead is kind of funny so i'm honestly almost done i just have to do my mascara okay i was literally just lifting my eyebrows and i want to go a little bit more i don't like the eyeshadow i need to go up higher or something i don't know and i might just do a clear gloss or fenty glow now the main problem is going to be the hair because i hate how it's drying today it's just not it's not going well i know it still looks very wet but it feels too fluffy and that's just not a good sign. Okay, so I got the hair parted down the middle, kind of. I just have my bangs kind of clipped up so that they hopefully curl nicely outwards. I had my clips in, but I didn't really, it was starting to crease my hair a little bit. But I'm just going to clip that back. And in the meantime, I also put some jewelry on. If I do go with this shirt, um, you know, it's short sleeve, so I thought the bracelet was cute. I just have this little necklace. And I love these braided, like, looking earrings. I thought they were cute. Wow, these bangs gorgeous so i added on my inner corner that merit balm it's a different type of balm it's the bounce highlighting balm so this is what it looks like i love it i don't ever use setting mist but i don't know i want to kind of try something this is a stay all day blue light micro setting mist what is blue light it honestly smells like rubber or something weird man i shouldn't have tried something new i kind of regret that i hate it <laughs> literally this part is sheer so I was gonna do boob tape, but you're gonna see my boobs, like, see the tape rather. They just don't want to stay up. I don't know if they're meant to, but but it kind of just wants to fall off. So I kind of feel like the straps almost look like it's on the shirt. So normally I hate when my bra straps are sticking out, but I feel like it kind of makes it look like it's part of the top, even though that's my bra. And literally every black bra that I have just was not working. And I have enough time that I might actually try to like pin the inside of this to the bra so that it all stays together. And I just have to lint roll my jeans, but this is going to be the fit, I think. With my purse. I love this little bag. I think it's so cute. Some Viva La Juicy. Wish me luck. I'll try to share some footage once I get there. And yeah, bye for now. So here we are headed to Philly. All the buildings were green for the Eagles, of course. The only thing that sucks now of me posting this the Super Bowl is technically tonight, but this video is going to be posted on Wednesday, so I don't know who's going to win the Super Bowl. Okay, we made it to our parking, my $55 parking, and it's only $50 if you pay here. So it was about a five minute walk from that parking lot, and here we are. We're just getting two shirts, and here's the stage, and they're about to come out. I had so much fun. I mean, they put on such a good show. Like, the energy, 10 out of 10. It was immaculate. And I'm going to post another video of just, like, clips from the show, because you know, I don't want to get copyrighted over here. And, you know, I had said earlier that I was kind of nervous about the seats, and it was where I was supposed to be. And I'm so excited to show you guys these next couple clips. So I'm not gonna lie, Wanye is definitely my favorite, but Sean, is was he singing to me in this clip? I don't know, you, you decide, he was though. I did get a rose from him because during a couple of the songs, like you were able to kind of go up to the stage. Look at him holding my hand, oh my God, girl. And then at the end, they were trying to like take pictures with people in the crowd. So I wanted to film so I had like video footage. Of course, when I flipped my camera around to like selfie mode record, I didn't press record. So thankfully my mom took these pictures of Sean posing for a picture I did not take. Either way, I had a great time. And you know what? I got to experience that even if I don't have the actual video footage. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. See ya.